Simon is unpredictable. Simon is unique. Simon is a renaissance man because he has many talents, like he can cook, he's a pretty good driver, and dance as I already mentioned, uh, and he's just a great coach. Uh, Simon is an awesome guy. I would couldn't, I guess, say that I'm the Mr. Miyagi of uh, track and field. I came to LIU because after talking with Simon, I felt like he could really, you know, heighten my career. I wasn't really highly recruited coming out of high school, so my trainer was friends with Simon. He said he's a good coach. One of the main reasons I came to LIU was just because when I was being recruited, Simon was just the coolest guy. I was saying if he was at any big school for sure, I was like, he would have the best athletes in the nation. I guess um, my athlete seems to think that I'm relatively crazy, uh, but we are, uh, I guess, a unique group of individuals. Yeah. A lot of people that will come into the university would say, like, how are you successful uh, without having anything? And to me, that really doesn't matter as long as you can get a group of individuals that are committed to trying to do their best, that are willing to come in and do different things, uh, that are willing to, I guess, put forth their effort both academically as well as athletically, we can basically achieve. Simon has helped me become a better person. He's raised my confidence because me not being recruited, I wasn't exactly sure I could compete on the collegiate level and Simon quickly showed me that if you believe and you put it into the universe, you can achieve it and go after it. Simon kind of motivated me, kind of put um, confidence in me, confidence I didn't know I had. And he, um, he ultimately made me a better person today. He says he has 20 different jobs. So some days he's a coach, some days he's a mentor, some days he's a father, some days he's a chef. Someday he thinks he's a dancer or a singer, so I mean, he just showed me a lot about life in general. Simon and I actually have the same birthday, so um, March 14th, we're both Pisces, so um, he calls me his other fish, because you know how Pisces symbol has like two fish revolving. So I always thought that was pretty cool, and the fact that my coach has the same birthday as me, I guess we have a <laughs> an even deeper connection than many would think. Favorite Simon moment? Um, My favorite Simon moment? One day, um, when we were about to start our practice, um, I think one of my teammates actually challenged Simon to a dance-off. I think what had to go earlier this year, when we were going out to a cold practice and out of nowhere we just had an impromptu dance battle. When it comes to dancing, there's nobody on my team that can, that, that can out dance me, whether it's my team or my coaching staff, so uh, I'm a relatively good dancer. I think he actually went on the floor and started rolling around, <laughs> and it was just funny. And then he just like, he just went back into coach mode like, okay, on the line. <laughs> I think everything that we do in practice, uh, some of it is very intense, but then a lot of it is fun. And we try to make sure that, um, you know, we don't put too much pressure on our athletes to go out there and perform. So as long as they're in a great mindset and uh, as long as we can, you know, keep them happy and keep them light and, you know, positive, you know, then we're going to be successful. We're like a, we're like a big, very dysfunctional, happy family. Even though we fight like brothers and sisters, we still get together and we're supportive just like how a family would be. At the end of the day, we are here for one purpose, and that is to run fast, to do as best as we can with all of our events, and the fact that we can motivate each other through our downs or even through our ups, it kind of just shows that we're more of a family that, than we even realize sometimes.
in my mind, I always think that, you know, we can win. I can take five people into a championship, and as long as it's athletes that are versatile and that can do two to three different events, and as long as they're focused on what they want to do and what we think that we can do, in my mind, you know, we're going to win.